On today's Toy Spot, we're having a look at the new NECA, Simpsons 25 of the Greatest Guest Stars Series 1. We're having a look today at Coach Homer Simpson. This collectible action figure, of course, comes from the new Simpsons 25 of the Greatest Guest Stars Series 1. Among some of the figures that you get, of course, all of them more so celebrities than anything else. Now, this particular wave has Homer Simpson, but certainly on the back of the package, the other figures that you can get from Series 1, we have Tom Hanks in the Simpsons movie, James Brown in Bart's Inner Child, Hugh Hefner in Krusty Gets Cancelled, Kid Rock in The Kill, the Alligator and Run, and Yao Ming in Homer and Ned's Hail Mary Pass. Um, the As for the Coach Homer Simpson, he comes from Season 16, Episode 8, in which the read-up says, air date is February 6, 2005, in Homer and Ned's Hail Mary Pass, Homer's wild dance celebrating his win at a charity carnival led him to found the Homer Simpson Showboating Academy, where he taught professional athletes the fine art of rubbing their success in the world's face. <laughs> awesome. This comes to us from the folks, of, again, uh, of course, again, from NECA Toys. You can head over to www.necaonline.com. You can see, certainly, the Simpsons figures that they're producing, as well as the wide range of other figures that they're producing as well. Spot's going to take himself a break. I'm going to get this opened up, and when we come back, we're going to get a better look at the 25 of the greatest guest stars, Series 1, Coach Homer Simpson. There's more anyway, guys. Don't go anywhere. Stay tuned. So, out of packaging, let's have a look at Coach Homer. This is certainly not the first Simpsons line of figures from a toy company. In fact, NECA handling the toy lines license from Simpsons, I think, makes it about the fourth toy line. There's an earlier line around the really the early days of Simpsons, and of course, Playmates handled the toy line for a very long time. Then McFarlane had their hand. Uh, producing Simpsons toys, more so really for the Simpsons movie, and now we have NECA. Of the figures released, I'm really impressed with NECA. Articulation-wise, they don't have a lot of articulation. In fact, getting the articulation out of the way first, Homer's head rotates left and right, his arms rotate all the way around, of course you see his hat coming off there as well, uh, and he also has a swivel in the waist. That's sadly the only thing that, uh, only nitpick I would have about this line is that it's a shame that the articulation is limited on these pieces. However, the trade-off, I would say, is probably the most accurate Simpsons figures that I have seen released from a toy company. Uh, Homer, for example, as we're looking at Homer being the first figure, looks like it was taken right out of the cartoon. He is holding his pigskin, his little football here, and this piece actually cannot come out of his hand. It's sculpted into the, the figure's hand. However, what you already saw earlier, his hat certainly can be removed, and uh, very singular paint applied on the majority of figure, once again, harking back to the fact that these look like they were taken right out of the cartoon. There's no additional shading, or, and even more importantly, things such as hats are all one color. Um, the face, as Spot really has already mentioned, the face is really nice. It it looks like it was taken right out of the cartoon, right down to Homer's trademark two hair, two hairs across his forehead. The hairs run the back section of his head as well, and down to his whatever a clock shadow, uh, whatever a clock uh, beard that he's got currently sporting as well. Now, he is in his tracksuit, his gray tracksuit, and the sculpting on the tracksuit is pretty good. Uh, right around these sleeves, as well as the bottom section of the tracksuit, all have like little creases, little folds to it, looking as if 
it is actual a fabric piece that you can remove. The same thing can be said for the bottoms of his pant legs too, also have the bunched up fabric, really adding to the fact that this looks like a really well sculpted piece. Um, as it also goes to, it's as far as I know, NECA is only going to be producing these as the 25 Greatest Guest Stars line. But seeing what they're producing now in these Simpsons figures, I would love to see them branch out to some extent and go back to what uh, you know to releasing just straight out Simpsons figures. I'd love to see them approach old Simpsons like just the basic clothing, basic uh, white shirt. You know, uh, Blue Pants, Homer, Marge, Bart, Lisa, Maggie, respectively, and approach the characters from the series. Now, they, uh, they're they geared towards scaling the figures roughly about the same scale as what we got with the Playmates toys. So, even though Spot doesn't really have one right now to show you, they're about the same height, give or take, to the Playmates toys. Really, to that extent, they could extend out. You could add these as new pieces to those existing Simpsons figures if you were collecting them before. As a whole, I am really happy with the pieces. Again, my only slight drawback, if I can make one, is I wish they had a little more articulation. Clearly gearing this line towards more something that is uh, reminiscent of the episodes, I would say, and less as a whole line in general, as my message to, to NECA, I would certainly love to see them approach the original Simpsons cast, uh, maybe not even so much dressed specifically to the episodes, but just a regular Simpsons line of figures. Uh, if they were to produce that, I certainly would be picking them up. As it goes for the rest of this line, I definitely want to be picking them up as well. If you really have enjoyed the Simpsons, and there has been a gap between you know the where the Playmates line ended and now where NECA has kind of essentially taken the reign to the Simpsons line, I'm extremely excited to see what they've got lined up for the remaining, I guess, I don't want to say the remaining 24 because we already know what Series 1 consisted of, but I'm certainly excited to see what the remaining characters will be in this line. Homer Simpson, really, from a paint level, from a sculpt level, and overall execution, I'm going to give him an 8.5. This is still probably one of my favorite Simpsons lines uh, to date. And it doesn't have necessarily the chip that the Playmates lines had. It doesn't necessarily have, you know, the simplicity that some of the older lines definitely had as well. But capturing the likeness of the cartoon, I think, is what NECA is clearly doing with this line. Today's Toy Spot, we were having a look at the new NECA Simpsons 25 of the greatest guest stars of all time. We're having a look at Series 1, Coach Homer. Stay tuned. Spot's going to have a look at the other figures making up the Series 1 of this NECA line of Simpsons figures. So stay tuned for that. Thanks for watching as you always do, guys. I'll see you guys next time.